Hello and welcome to day 10 of the DIY Super Electric Longboard Scooter Build. Today we work on the speed controller and the wiring. So I start out here finishing up what I was working on last time was the battery tie down. I start finishing up the holes and running the bolt through it. I ended up having to run to the hardware store and buy bolts which is why I didn't finish this last time. I needed a way to mount the sliding pinchiometer, which will be my speed controller. I found this reflector for a bicycle and thought this would be the perfect thing to attach my pinchiometer to the handlebars. And what do you know, it looks like it will. I'm going to mount the speed controller up here on the right side of the handlebars. The brake handle here has a switch in it and it actually deactivates the motor when the brake is applied as an added safety bonus, which I'm very happy to have. The wires from the pinchiometer are ran down the handlebars and zip tied in place. I leave quite a bit of slack before I run the wire to the frame. And then now I'm running my own three different wires to extend it due because this is such a long scooter. A little bit of soldering, heat shrink, electrical tape, some more zip ties, and there we go. We're all done for today. Stay tuned as there may be a part 11. We're planning on adding a speedometer, battery meter, new inner tube, possibly brakes, and maybe more. Also, please consider helping if you can on Patreon today. Thank you very much. Please be sure to like, subscribe, follow, watch our playlist, and all of the above. Thank you.